I didn't say it, but somebody else in the class did. And it was kind of interesting because the response was like, yeah, so like, isn't that normal? Like, it, you know, it was kind of, I don't know. It's just one of those old system kind of things that's just perpetuating through. It's like textbooks are supposed to be expensive. And do you know how many chapters I read out of that book? Like three. I, I did have to tell my professors at one point in college, like I was not, I was like barely making it. And so I was lucky because I had classmates. My classes were like a little bit smaller at that time. So I just sat by someone with the book and I'm just like, hey, um, you know, I'm going through some like life stuff right now. I don't have enough to purchase textbooks, um, but here's my plan. And I just told them, like, you know, I have, I'm friends with this person. They have the books for me. And my professors have all been like really open minded and really understanding of it. Um, and then especially once COVID-19 hit, they're just like, yo, we got you. Don't even <laughs> don't even worry. So luckily, my response has always been positive. Um, I, I know that might just be department to department, but like I love my department. They've been so good. They even reached out. I forgot about this. They even reached out at the beginning of the semester or the beginning of last semester. And they're like, uh, the department chair, uh, Dr. DeSanzo, he's like, if anybody needs anything, you need textbooks, you need help with rent, you need anything, reach out to us, we got you. And I'm going to say that is awesome. So I, I really love my department. I'm grateful for them.